we did compare all the options there, right? In China, in Hong Kong, in the US. But still, as a very young internet company, still very rapidly growing, I think the investor base here still understand our business best. While well, think about it in Hong Kong, other than Tencent, I can't really think of any sizable internet media company there. But in the US, there's just uh, more than 10 just out of China. So I think this is the right investor base. That's what, what, we, are, what we think is the most important. I will say, did you see a Meituan list in Hong Kong? They raised about $4 billion. But back to your business, I am interested. Uh, Chu Tatiao means fun headlines. Give That's me right. a little bit more color on what exactly you do. How does Chu Tatiao make money? Sure. So we are actually um, quite in a, a uh, innovative type of uh, technology-driven media companies, unlike uh, the older model where the media produce their own content, we don't produce any content. We aggregate content from various professional media and freelancers. Then we push customized feeds to the users. So here the secret recipe is not the content, it's really the algorithm. The algorithm finds out each user's interest, their behavior, and then push the most relevant content. So it's really a new technology-driven model. Uh, I haven't seen really something like this in the US, but in China this has been proven to be a very uh, powerful model. And in terms of uh, our revenue, right, our monetization, that mainly comes from advertising. I'm curious, though, these platforms, um, folks where the content is found, in the U.S. you've seen a lot of concern around the likes of Twitter and Facebook. I know they have different business models, but I think the concern um, could potentially be the same. Is this real content? Is this relevant content for users? Is there fake news? Is that something that you're thinking about in the Chinese market? Do Chinese consumers have the same uh, kind of issues around veracity of content that we're seeing here right now in the U.S.? Yeah, I totally agree. It's uh, probably the same situation in China, even probably worse uh, with this uh, explosion in, in terms of the information available on the internet, right? There comes a lot of uh, fake news, lower quality content, uh, and uh, we actually, as a platform, right, we aggregate all the content. We spend a lot of time on basically ruling out all these lower quality content. That's a very important part of our job. And we want to make sure that the algorithm and also our editor teams pick, pick out all the best content and push the relevant content to user also based on the interest, not just the interest and also the quality. Both are very important. Interesting. So you do have actual humans there checking this and, and kind of curating content for the right people. Uh, yes, we have, uh, okay, we have two, uh, two levels of uh, content inspection. First of all, the, that's the artificial intelligence powered a, a, machine, uh, a machine interface. So that will screen out some of the lower quality content uh, or inappropriate content. And then we have a team of more than 500 people sitting there. They will review all the content and grade them. Uh, the content with lower grade will have minimal exposure to the users. I am curious, uh, Chu Tao Tiao is only a two-year-old company. It's been the trend here in the U.S. for big private tech companies to wait longer. The average wait time is about nine years between founding and IPO. Why go now? A lot of uh, your peers in China seem to be listing earlier. What's behind the decision to list now just two years into your life? Sure, sure. I think actually um, the listing is more about the branding and less about the money. It is actually even easier to raise money in the private market compared with the public market, but the status of being a public company does give us a lot of uh, additional uh, brand image, uh, uh, credibility, and that's very important for doing business in China and I guess probably anywhere in the world. The users trust us more, right? So they feel it's more, uh, more credible, so that's, uh, that's help, that helps the business a lot actually.